Here's a quick tour of inside my classroom. So inside the door, these are the three expectations of students. Super learners will use technology responsibly, behave respectfully, collaborate reliably. And then they're greeted with this board right here. My goal for this year is that students feel empowered teach technology so I want them to always be mindful that if they're not willing for the entire world to see it or would not want it posted about them they should not post it here's my favorite part of the room my little superhero grandkids reminding my students of what they need to be doing I'm going to move these balls out of the way so you can see them Here's my little Batman. And then I will try to give my students alternative ways to do their work. So this is our ball pit that some fifth graders created last year. And uh, so they have the option to sit on a ball instead of a chair. This is the headphone bins where I will store their headphones and their username and password sheets. There are no tape, chairs around the tables because like I said, I give them um, a choice in how they want to sit. The computers are stored over here. They're numbered, so each student is assigned a number. And then there's a place located or marked on the counter where they know where to return their computer ready for the next class. This is where I place the iPods that they can check out. And then back here, I'm planning on putting this table up on risers so that it's tall enough for them to stand if they want to have a standing option. This back here will be the makerspace area. So I'm gonna get labels on all these buckets. This came out of the library, this really cool seating option. This. These little crates right here are stacked tall enough that a student can set their computer right here and be able to stand and work at their computer. So that's another option. This is a little short table where they can work the puzzle. I've got things stored in these desks, like there's an erector set that they can pull out. And like I said, this, all of these buckets will be the things that they're able to come pull from when they wanna do makerspace. So they'll have a choice in what they wanna work with. Got another little short table here with things stored and some noodles. And then back here we have the green screen. This is our recording studio. We do morning announcements right here. So we have a really nice setup with, with uh, mics that go into the camera, a green screen, and then we have a puppet theater. And they can choose. We've got a whole box full of puppets right here where they can write their own puppet skits and record them. And last year, at the end of the year, we got this new addition, which is a 3D printer with a really nice computer setup to be able to do that. And then this is my robotics table where the robotics, they'll use the NXT robots to program and we'll set things up here for challenges. And that's a quick look at my classroom.